So how can we think about uh, Christian involvement in society and in politics? I think the uh, description that Os Guinness, or the three models Os Guinness has given us, is very helpful. He distinguishes between uh, what he calls uh, the sacred square, which is where one religion is dominating. Like, for example, in my country, we, we had a state church for 400 years. So that is one model. You have one religion, one perspective. That is the prescribed perspective, and all others are excluded. And historically, that has, of course, been the most common way of operating in, in most cultures. And still, you will have some Christians thinking in, in that kind of terms. We need to return to a sacred and, in the meaning, then a Christian public square. The second model is to think of uh, a naked public square. Uh, and that is what we have uh, in Sweden now, I would say. Then you say, uh, we have to uh, get rid of all uh, religions from the public square. So you are allowed to be religious in your private life and in your home, but in the public square we are neutral. So it's naked. In reality, that is, of course, a myth. And in reality, uh, it's, at least in my country, it then becomes the secular agenda, which is the new prescribed uh, perspective that everyone should hold on to in the public square. Uh, the third alternative, and which is, the I think, the preferred one, the, the right one, is the civil public square where everyone is allowed into the public square with their deepest convictions, with their religious views. And everyone can be uh, honest and true to themselves. And we need to find a civil way to meet on the public square and to have an open and frank dialogue. So I have the right to be a Christian on the public square and the secular uh, person have the right to be secular there and the Muslim have the right to come as a Muslim and then we need in a civil way to discuss how can we live together how can we create a society together where we keep the respect uh, towards each other and I think that is the model we need to uh, to strive for that will be a model where there is uh, freedom uh, for everyone